Welcome back everyone. We are now having to deal with Ludwig chasing after us. It's gonna be a pain because... Shit! Where did he go? Because I kept getting caught multiple times by him. Okay. Yeah, he is behind that. I do not like these chase scenes. Where the heck am I? I can't see. The game just kind of glitched there. You know, I don't feel like these headphones are on. So we might be caught. We'll see. I just have to remember to skip over some of those parts. I'll have to go through there again. Do I have to go through here? That's so... <laughs> My biggest problem is I get so confused on where I'm supposed to go. Make your peace. Our collective suffering! Well, that was quick. We only got caught that one time in the last episode. There he is at the bottom right. Can hardly see him with how bright and dark it is. <coughs> Am I supposed to go? Okay, can't go that way. Otherwise, she'll burn and scream like Ludwig did. Can't climb up. I can't go in the blazing infer inferno down there. No, it won't let me jump. Oh, there you go. Just avoid the fire. <coughs> Rose! <coughs> Rose! Is that you? You sound terrible! Aubrey? 
Where the hell have you been? I could have used you like five minutes ago. You found the notebook, didn't you? I bet you did! Right? Right? Yes, Aubrey. I got the notebook. And then I ran into Ludwig. Oh no. Are you okay? I'm fine, Aubrey, and thankfully... Ludwig took a face full of fire, so that's one problem less. Wow! One piece of great news after another. What's next? The bad news? I'm lost. I, I think there's an elevator here, but I can't really tell. It's too dark. Aha! Not a problem. Pay attention to the lights around you, and let me know when they start blinking. All right? Sure. We have like two. Wait, is it two more? Anything yet? No, nothing. Wait! Now! Aubrey, now! Oh, that's deck 66. Next order of business, getting you that elevator. Fantastic, Aubrey. Thank you again for everything. I'm coming to make good of my promise. No idea how good that sounds. Uh, wait, let me get the doors. Oh, god damn it. What's wrong? There's. Ugh, gross. There's the body of a man crucified against the elevator wall. Is there a different elevator you can send up? I'd rather not. It's. It's the only one. It's the only one, Rose. I hate this place. I hate this place so much. Well, not look at him as much. <sighs> one leaf in, one thorn out. Thanks for doing this, Rose. Yeah. Because we don't need to be looking at a decapitated guy that might be, I don't know what you'd say, with a crucified, so. Any of the gory stuff, I just. Guys, just skip over it. The Strife of Eris, Chapter 7. I think in total there are chap 10 chapters. I don't know why I was thinking a 30 in like a minute earlier. I have to make. Oh? I told you that I had a family, but I don't. That was a lie. I'm a liar, Rose. I'm sorry. That's okay, Aubrey. Glad to hear it, because I'm afraid you've got a bit of work to do before you can get to my end of the engine halls. But of course I do. What a surprise. Where do I go? Mm. Make your way to the local engine hall. You'll have to find a way to the other side of it. Yes! The power coupling, Spenny! Hey, Rose. I gotta sort this out. I'll be back in a jiffy. Just don't... Don't what? Aubrey? Aubrey! Great. He's not wrong. He is a liar. He wasn't lying about that. Oh yeah, we're going to have to wait until electricity turns back on. We are currently in this corner right now. We weren't too long ago over here in the big square one in the theater. Oh yeah, and then... Let's see, let's get that bridge. This guy was hiding there for some reason. Is there like a note or anything? I don't see a note back there and not on this side either. I'm guessing the mon like the 
little trick monster. Got a hold of him. Maintenance report of 2318. Inspection verdict failed. If you guys want to read what this... Okay, I'll read Tech Department Maintenance Division. No, oh, I'll read this. Let's see. Inspector's notes how these power couplings are still functioning beyond me. Look at them. The only thing holding them together is rust and dust, but that's not the scary part. You know what happens if these were to fail? First, the D12 panel would overload, pre preventing the automatic pressure equalizer from recovery. Receiving an update, the value is not recovered. Okay. Normally, this would cause the local heat trigger to flip, preventing the situation from escalating, but since the heat trigger is entirely missing, that won't happen. The result is catastrophic pressure building in discharge tanks, causing a great sea explosion where anywhere from four to 10 casualties, depending on the um, shift would be expected. If you want to gamble with lives, at least have the common decency to say so openly, assholes. Aubrey King, Technology Department, Maintenance Division. Uh, I don't think we found the other. She knows who we're supposed to in the last area. My favorite one, like, favorite one, some of these games we've been playing lately we have like pure source. So if you have kids watching, I should never turn the handle. I think I did, like, just fair warning again. If you don't want them listening in, if they are watching or not. But I feel like a lot of games are gonna have a lot of things no matter what. This game is like mostly dark stuff, playing it with any kind of light on. It's hard, I always keep the light on so you guys can actually see me. Maybe I should do one of those like shaded things. Let's see. If I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go now. <coughs> she's such a slow runner, I swear. She's like the slowest runner. Let's see, where were we lost? Were we over here? I think so. Let's wait a second for that to turn back on. There we go. Uh, Rose? Aubrey. Can you do something about the power coming and going? I thought you had that area covered. Uh, there's a bit of a hiccup with this, uh, with a large electromagnetic distribution coil. It seems to be pulsating. Yeah, that means nothing to me, Aubrey. Speak plainly. Rosie, we are harvesting electricity from time itself. This shit is complicated, okay? You just find a way forward and don't die. Ah, great plan, Aubrey. Your best work yet. You hear that, Benny? Rose is giving me attitude. <laughs> oh, okay, that guy up there is talking to them. Oh, something. Oh, right. I don't know if it's gonna work. Look, I would have to be quick because of the power train on and off.
Oh, power's back on again. Because it turns off so quick, so. Let me go back over here. I swear she is the slowest runner of all time. By the time I get over here, this thing turns, the electricity turns off. Give the electricity a second to turn off. There we go. We are in chapter seven still, so we are definitely getting closer. Guess I could just use that ladder. Get up here. Wait, does this ladder lead into a different room? Because that bridge is if you remove your Rose, you are there, Rose? Yeah, I'm still here, Aubrey. I made it across the engine hall. What now? Up ahead is hydraulics and pressure control. The distribution coil is boiling the storage tanks, so you're going to have to reduce the pressure in order to get the security doors to open. Find the pressure valves, Rose. Turning them should bring the pressure down. Okay. Find the valves to reduce pressure. Got it. Great, Rose. You're almost here. Okay. Talk to you in a bit. Alright. Three valves. get the valves on then I think you just have to like mess with them a little bit oh that's what I did like last time I just messed with them a little bit after the valves were placed on and it, and it. Aubrey years of Aubrey Ugh. I think one of them was like missing the valve. I don't think it's here. I think we just need to like reduce the pressure on them. Oh, I forgot it's not just three, it's multiple valves. And a few of them are like missing the I don't know if I could ever handle being in this part of the ship, trying to maintain everything, electrical and stuff like that. Not my forte. A cup of tea or whichever one you want to see. Ooh, a lighter. Roll with the hit and run. Rescue will come. The okay, let's see this. 
Hmm. We've been. This one's been like the longest one thus far. Let's see. I think we're missing at least one or two more of the. Those little valve things. I think there's like one in a room or something. Like in, inside this room. There's one over there. I don't know if we touched that one yet. Let's see, there's one over here. No, that just increases the pressure. Let's go to this one over here. Did we touch this one? Wait, what's... I thought there was something she could pick up. Let's see, new collectible. Spectacularly failed. Did... Yep, Aubrey, you rolled this one again. Again. Mains report 2411. Ready to fail. Well, the way these people continue to disappoint me is truly astonishing. The CAP transfer cables are not supposed to be connected to current to the current control system. Just because the cable spit doesn't mean they're supposed to connect there. The two systems operate on entirely different frequencies, meaning that all the power readings we've collected since the last inspection will have to be thrown out since the valves have been compromised. How the hell are we supposed to keep the Helios running effectively without Elaw pissing away our chances to take accurate measurements? Mandatory systems and cables review session on Tuesday, 9 p.m. We will go for as long as needed until everyone has an intimate understanding of the required cable connections. Aubrey King, Technology Department, Maintenance Division. Let's see. There's one here. That just increases the pressure. There we go. Once I open the door, let me just see if there are any notes. One more hurdle. What's up next? Well, you remember that malfunction in supersized electromagnetic distribution coil? It's... You know what? Some things just need to be seen. Come on through! No, well now I have to figure out where the heck that door is. Door, oh, right here in front of me. Okay, hurt. 
for these suits. Luckily, it's just a game. Does anyone else play through this game? Does anyone else know what those little green symbols mean? Apart from seeing them in the letters and stuff like that. could sink our ship. I don't see any notes. This supersized electromagnetic distribution coil. The Tesla coil. Ugh. I'm gonna call it Fred. Oh shit. Directly exposed to the shock wave, you should be fine. Good to know. You should be able to see me. I'm in the tall building to your right. See me in the window there, Rose. Anyway, you see that building on fire in the distance? That's where you'll find the emergency deactivation switch. Wait, all the way over there? At the other end? Yep. You want me to sprint there while Electromag something or other regularly fries the entire place? Yep. <sighs> I've been thinking about this part. If it's alright with you, I'll open the door on the left and just hide in a corner for a while, okay? Of course. I, I wouldn't want you screaming in my ear anyway. I just wish I knew there was an auto save right now. I just don't know when this coil is gonna go off again. I really wish they'd give us a manual save in the game. Well, these just. If anything, like a. I don't know. There it goes, I do not want to get caught. Now that we're out here, it's gonna, it feels like it's gonna go up every like few seconds.
Meanwhile, guys, I might just leave the game here, and if I have to go through all this chapter again on my own, I will. But I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for stopping by and watching.